It's been six months since the Memorial Day weekend kicked off weeks of summertime travel chaos. Fast forward to Thanksgiving and what a difference. Two million plus flyers each day this week, with FlightAware reporting fewer than 60 flights canceled so far and only 15% of flights delayed. I think they're anticipating the crowd and they're just keeping it going nicely. After going on a massive hiring binge, the airlines say they now have the most employees on record, though they still need more pilots. They've also trimmed their schedules to avoid a repeat of the summer mess. The FAA says it's also increased air traffic control staffing, though blue sky flying conditions have made a big difference this week. A cautious transportation secretary on CNBC this morning. I think we're still many months away from getting to a level where we're all confident that the system could fully absorb a major weather event. But most Americans are driving this week with gas prices well below the $5 mark last June. Shannon and Justin Foran just spent 22 hours on the road with their two kids from Tamworth, New Hampshire to Hudson, Florida, stopping in Hershey Park, PA along the way. It was probably about half of what it would have cost for two of us to fly. Mm -hmm. Meanwhile, the National Safety Council warns this could be the deadliest Thanksgiving since 2007, with a potential for nearly 520 traffic fatalities. The reminder before we all head out, stay safe on the roads and in the sky. Back here at the airport, and I got to say, the airlines are so full that some reserved parking spots at airports are taken. They're full. They're gone including SeaTac, Washington Dulles, as well as Atlanta, Midway, O'Hare, so LAX. So if you're flying, you may still get a parking spot, but you won't be able to reserve. Those spots are gone already. Guys, back to you. All right, Tom Costello, going to be a busy one. Thank you. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific, on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day, or click the link right here.